The climate change or global warming. It does not change your warming anymore. We better call it climate crisis, or even better we call it climate emergency. The number nine. That is the year we have to hold climate change. The climate change will not stop immediately, even if we stop all the emissions of carbon dioxide right now. For instance, the rising sea level will continue for more than 1,000 years, according to the supercomputer simulation. But there is a hope. Its name is direct air capture. It is a branch of geoengineering technology that can remove carbon dioxide from the air directly. Here is the example of DSC. Wow, so huge! We can almost see the person standing at the end of this machine. I want to ask all of you that have you ever seen this machine before or have you ever heard this machine before? Maybe not, I suppose. So my point is that in order to hold climate change, we must begin to change individual consciousness. Because when you change, when you see the world, you can change the world, you see. So we need a machine that we can easily use in our everyday life and can interact with. So today, I want to show all of you the machine that I invented. The very smallest CO2 removing machine. This is our hope. Just call it Hiyase. Hiyase is an innovative machine that can remove carbon dioxide from the air directly to avoid global warming. Hiyase derived from the Japanese verb Hiyasu, which stands for cool something down. So Hiyase can cool the earth down. By only pushing the button, you can remove carbon dioxide from the air. And the amount of carbon dioxide that it can remove from the air is almost the same as 15 cedar trees can. So you can make a forest at your home. And also, Hiyase has an artificial intelligence so you can chat with it. I think that in order to solve the problem of global warming, we must begin by changing how we think about the issue. We tend to feel helpless when we confront the global level problem. But with, our, with this device in our homes and office, I'm sure we could begin to feel like agents of change. The idea of 7.7 .7 billion people on Earth having the power to stem global warming by only pushing a button is far more attractive and some scientists grappling the specialized endeavors that hardly anyone understands, don't you think? So, how can we use this CO2 that we remove from the air? This is what I'm doing right now, called Solarium Project. Sola stands for the sky in Japanese, and I can convert carbon dioxide that we remove from the sky into gasoline which is used as fuel for cars, trains, and ships, rockets, airplanes, etc. Actually, I found chemical reaction that can convert carbon dioxide into methane, which is known for natural gas. That has been undiscovered for more than 100 years in 2017, when I was in high school. And my new factory that convert carbon dioxide into gasoline is under construction in Chiba Prefecture and will be open by the end of this month. So this December. Alright then, so we can remove carbon dioxide from the air and also we can convert it into fuel. So what's next? My final goal is to set foot on Mars and convert Martian CO2-covered atmosphere into fuel for rockets to return to the Earth and realize Martian colonization. So, my dream in my entire life is to save the Earth and explore the Mars. This 
is what I'm doing now. And this is a way to save the entire human race by holding climate change and also realizing Martian colonization. I'm gonna do everything that I can do for this planet's future, and someday, I wanna be in school books around the world as the man who stopped climate change. Thank you.